Today we're out here at Disney's Fantasia Gardens Mini Golf playing their fairways course, which is the world's hardest mini golf course. It is amazing, top five for sure. Let us know, Team Alicia, Team Brooks, if you think it's gonna win, it's gonna be a great time, let's do it. Hole one, starting off with a par three, it's 65 feet, straight through and down. If you guys are new and never, great shot. Oh Lord. Oh wow. Never mind. Um, that went from good to something. Thanks. So, sorry. But if you're new around here, <laughs> I might do the same thing. If you're new and haven't seen us play this course before, you are in for a treat. It's definitely the hardest and one of the best courses in the world. It's incredible. That's too hard, I already know it. I might want to go ahead. I think I'm right in front of you. Oh, so close. Start with the par. It's gonna be close. Ugh. It's just hole one, we're getting warmed up. <laughs> Nothing. Fantastic. It's just the start. Now hole two, par four, 83 feet. You wanna to try to slingshot it in between the bunkers. Where's got those ball markers at, whatever those are called. I might go for it. Maybe you'll skip through the grass or into the other grass. Okay. It's kind of where it tells you to end up. Also for anyone wondering, the par for this course is 72, which is insane. We'll see how we do against it. Oh Lord. Welcome to the party. He's willing to join me, I know it. Totally. I don't want to take a drop, so I'm gonna to try to hit it out of this and hope. And you'll know if it's a good idea or not. It keeps sloping. What? <laughs> wow. That worked. That was all luck. Take that for how you want with uh, choosing yours. If it is that hump, it's gonna probably roll back. Mm -mm. Still not bad. You can go. Do we tap mine in? Yeah. That was so lucky. Still getting a three after being in the grass is pretty great. Hole three is a par five. It is 99 feet and it's a dog leg right, so good luck. <laughs> I don't even remember where the hole is at on this. Will I have enough speed? You should be able to straight shot it from there. I don't, I think you're in a better spot than me. This is the first time we've played that they've added these like ball markers on the ground. Those weren't here before to let you know where you should like aim to stop. And you actually got right at it. So that's pretty good. And also shout out to the workers here. They've seen the videos of us playing, which is awesome. You're definitely safe. Roll back, roll back. I'm gonna be behind that hill. You're behind All the right. hump, but you're not in the bunker. I have to go right through the bunker. Oh, I hope I don't go in the back bunker after this. Actually, you know, ah, oh, dang it. Now I think I'm gonna do this. That worked perfectly. I did not think that was gonna work. Go ahead. That was an eagle. Close. That's still really good. Thank you. Now for hole four, it's a par four, 83 feet to the left this time, to the flag over there. 
the balls say to line it up just like straight ahead and then go for it. So I'm gonna listen to them and hope I don't go in that bunker. Usually I try to schwack it and send it around, but I might try to use my noodle and follow their advice this time. <laughs> Cause I feel like they're there for a reason. We've never had them here. But hey, shout out to the course for adding stuff to improve the game. This is one of the best courses in the world. Definitely the hardest course in the world for a mini golf course. They even claim that it is. So adding stuff like that's awesome additions. You might be able to slingshot it around, but I don't know. Oh, sorry, I didn't realize she hit. <laughs> okay. Great minds think alike. I don't know which way's better for this. I might try to go through the drain. Stay right. Oh, it worked. Wow. Pretty good. Thank you. You can go ahead and get up on the green. Okay. Oh, Aww. so close. This is one of the hardest holes here. It's par five, 109 feet. There's a ton of bunker. And you can kind of see straight ahead where that red ball is, I guess where to aim for. But I don't know if you want to be on the left side or right side, because there's bunker all around there. It almost looks like you want to aim for right on the back side of that first bunker. There's a little bit of a landing area, if you can get it to curve around it somehow. Well, it, it might clear it. No. Nah. Uh, that's hard. Ah. That's probably too hard. Oh, wow, it worked. Okay. Somebody else went in there. <laughs> they gave up on this hole. It's gonna be a schwack it. One bunker to the other. Oh no. <laughs> hey, you're still warming up. I need to be a little more that way to clear this. Wanted to hit it hard just so it doesn't go in the bunker. Don't go in the other one. Please sit. Whew. I'm getting very lucky. Hard. You can go ahead. So this is four for you and I'm on three. Oh. Four for me. That rolls fast. Hello, excuse me. <laughs> hey, what's up, dudes? Y'all getting ready to have a battle? <laughs> now I got a par four, 75 feet down the hill. Excuse us. Excuse me. Excuse, excuse me. me. Sorry, little dude. Oh, he's going sideways. I think they was about to have a battle. Those are different looking. They have like a, almost like a fin on their back. This is like you either make it all the way to the hole or you're going in the bunker. One of the two always happens. I'm going in the bunker. <laughs> I want to just clear these rocks on the right. Oh, yep. You have to have the perfect speed to get around that. That was too hard. Next, it's basically just play it as far on the left side as you possibly can. Out of all the holes here, this one does have hole in one potential. Oh, you were so close to. Told I thought you, I was you were going to sit the there bunker. for a second. Okay, make it all the way to the bottom or you end up in this bunker. I just don't want to go in that one now. And everything leans towards it. 
Kick back. No. Yeah, I ran out of luck. Go ahead. I'm in there. My luck is gone. That is so hard if you get stuck in this one. One bunker to the oath. Sit. Don't take much. <laughs> I'm going ahead. That's a good spot. Please. I did not expect to get par on that. Next is a par four with 77 feet. Got to sling it through the bunkers to the hole in the back. Oh, I, I thought you I was were gonna going to clear it. I thought I was going in the middle one, but I knew I was going into one of them. <laughs> we played this course so many times. There's a few holes I feel like we've really figured out and some like this that I've yet to figure out what you're supposed to do. I kind of worked. I just realized where the balls are, it's basically telling you to land it here and then hit it up there. I could curve it really good. Keep curving. Oh, it's still rolling. Wow, great shot. It's about time. Hey, it just took you the first six holes. That was the warm up. I have to try to hit this hump and come back. Keep rolling. Go, 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 go. Mm. You can go. I think we both got a birdie on this one. I think you got this. I don't even know how many it took. Oh, I was just three. We both got a three. Yeah, I don't speak none of this golf stuff. Tell me a number. You got a lizard. <laughs> no, I still don't know what that is. Tell me a number. You got a three. Okay. Bar three, 63 feet. Pretty much a straight shot. You definitely want to go to the right. I hope I can clear this hump. Oh, that bounced back in. Sit somewhere I'm off the green. At least I didn't go out of bounds. I could have really good speed. Still not bad. All right. Great that, shot. That little. That was good. You had a little guide for you? Yeah. Oh, no, I can see it more what you're talking about right here. Tombang is going to curve, but not sure how much. Darn you, Leaf. <laughs> I don't know if it would have had it, but I'm going to think it did. A 78 foot par four for this one. You got a really slingshot to the left. I get to say to end up just kind of in that middle area on the left side and then hit it up or to swack it and hope for a good bounce off the rocks. You got options. That's basically where you want to end up. All right. I was hoping it would kick that way. I think we're right where we're supposed to be. Also, we were looking when we came in, the all-time course record for this is 45. That's insane. Wow. What a shot. That was all luck. <laughs> that was great. It just took the first few holes for you to warm up. Oh no. And I have used up all my luck. I'll go ahead, you're on the green. Mm -hmm. I have no idea where this is gonna go. Please don't be too hard. Darn it. Let me just keep going since you're right here. Go ahead. Okay. Just don't knock me away. If I do, we will put you back. For this course, we'll do that for if we hit into each other. Oh, 
I can feel it. Like that, here. You were right here. I made sure because I didn't know where I was going to end up. Ah, that's a bogey. That was a great three. Good job. That was luck, not skill. Sometimes luck is all you need. This is another one of the harder holes here. Par four, 89 feet, but there's bunker running all the way around. And then there's one also at the top behind the flag. I'm gonna listen to the sign and aim for that drain because it looks like that's kind of where the ball markers are. They're not gonna need very much. Okay, he needs more than that though, Brooks. Dang it. I don't know why I had that so light. I ain't saying nothing, that's been my game. <laughs> I started off real strong, I thought, too. And man, it just fell apart here. So I think it's basically just do what I did, but a little bit harder. Is it gonna be safe? That is, a that sits there, that is a great spot. Good job. Thanks. I know I'm going to the back bunker. I can feel it. Please. No, but I'm gone. I knew it. I didn't stand a chance. Again, I'm not saying nothing. <laughs> I've literally been doing nothing but bunker hopping. Hope. You're going to be safe. Nice. Please just stay up here. Baby steps. <laughs> oh. oh. Thought about it. Did not think that was gonna work. <laughs> Long straight shot, 77 feet, another par four. This one also has hole in potential if you can get it to roll up there, right? Well, oh. Almost had it. You were so, still not a bad spot to end up. Well, I ended up where they said to be, but. Yeah, so you're good. It was so close to going up it. I really hope I don't hit you. <laughs> we'll find out. No, no, no. Whew. Clear it. Go in. No yep. way. Let's go. I like to say that I inspired you. You did. I basically did exactly what you did, but just like a smidge harder. Oh my gosh. We've not made it on this one before. That was a good shot still. I cannot believe that went in. I'm happy I could be an inspiration. You were, girl. Y'all, drop some love a little bit for me getting the hole in one, I appreciate it, but for the inspiration. Get some love in the comments for her. I need it. I have a little <laughs> bit of a nasal problem going on. It's true, the allergies down here is hitting Alicia pretty rough. The temperature's spiking up and down like crazy. Get it, lizard. Now we got another par five. 94 feet and this one actually has hole in one potential also if you can get the right roll around it a lot of the humps kind of guide you towards the hole i'm gonna try to go hard left and go on like the inside bunkers or okay. the inside humps stay in between them oh no i'm in the rocks somewhere i see you if it would have had a little bit more and caught in between those last two humps, it would have stayed on the green and it kind of funnels. That's gonna be close. You're safe. Wow. Go. Great shot. Thank you. Normally, if someone's on the green, the other person can go, but since there's a good chance I hit you and knock you away, you can go ahead. That's a two on a par five. Wow. I hope y'all took note. <laughs> rewatch that shot. Just over and over and over like, again. Go back and rewatch. 
If you keep watching that shot over, it doesn't look like I did as bad. Oh. Roll back, roll back, roll back. Mm. Can you imagine getting a hole in one on a hole like this? That'd be sick. I just love how much you can just like purposefully swack it on this course. And that's like part of the strategy on a lot of them is just hitting it hard. You just get distracted by ducks. All three of them disappeared. <laughs> I think you might be able to see that in the background when I'm talking. I just love how much you can just like purposefully swack it on this course. We got another par five, 86 feet, a lot of bunkers to the hole up top up there. This is a really hard one though. Yeah. Everything leans in towards them. The ball markers are all the way up there, saying you should somehow get it up there without going in a bunker. I yeah. have no idea how. I've tried. I can only stay out of the bunkers for so long. <laughs> a little bit lighter and ride this hump. Maybe. Maybe it'll sit there. That was me attempting to use my noodle. Sometimes it works. This is Baby Yoda using the force for not letting you bring him out. I thought for a sec you were gonna roll into the other one. <laughs> no, I mean, if I did, it's not like I haven't already done it. <laughs> Please don't be too hard and roll to the back. Slowly but surely. That's still great. Thank you. Oh my gosh. Go. Par three, 69 feet. Down the hill. Nice. If you can get the right roll, this also has hole-in-one potential. It kind of funnels, but that is not the roll. Clear the hump. Up. I think you have to almost get it to like hit it hard and somewhat catch this and get it to pull it to the left. And maybe then it'll actually get down there because it funnels a little bit around the hole. You're in the grate. Great. What you can do is put it back on, it won't count against you, you can put it back on this part because all the grates don't count as out of bounds. Even that one. So you can go ahead if you want to since you're right here. I'll catch the hill and roll down. <laughs> Hoping for a backboard. Yeah. I'm just gonna have to hit the flag for this to go in. Man, that cut back. I thought this one had hole in one potential on it. And I got a bogey with a four. All right. Another par three, 70 feet this time. So one foot longer. There's a lizard sitting on top of the ball. He's watching. He's on the ball. <laughs> That's what I said, he's sitting on top That's of That's hilarious. It. This one funnels also, if you can manage to get it to not go hard right, because everything leans that way on the other side of the bridge. Someone else gave up on this hole too. That might be safe staying left. Stop. Will it roll, which way is it gonna, oh, oh right on the hump. Did. I wish I remembered how I got a hole in one the last time or two times ago we played this. Yeah, I don't remember at all. How'd that sit there? He's just vibing on that thing. Also, shout out to all you guys. If you're still watching this video, I'm sure this is a long one. If you've made it this far in the video, thank you so much. If you have, let us know your favorite Pop-Tart flavor in the comments. That way there's no context to the video, but people know and we know that you've made it this far into the video because we really appreciate you for sticking around. Thank you. Alicia, what's your favorite flavor? That was a good shot. A discontinued flavor. 
the blue raspberry and cream, the pink and white, I mean the blue and white stripe one. Yeah, 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 that was a vibe. They did away with that. She was so upset about that too. My, I was, I was basic, like this, the brown cinnamon sugar or the strawberry frosted ones, I was basic, but they were good. Well, I could have told you, but you were basic. Wow. <laughs> yeah, guys, let us know. That way we know you've made it this far in the video. Favorite Pop-Tart flavor? Let us know in the comments. And plus, it'll make us hungry, and anyone else that reads the comments, it might make them hungry, and that's kind of funny. But for real, really appreciate y'all watching this far into the video. Stick around to the end. I know we're not gonna break the course record. Maybe we'll break the daily record? I don't know what that is, but I know the course record's 45, so we'll see. I know I'm not. <laughs> we got the rock and roller. Par four, 89 feet. It's saying just lay it up into the middle. Yeah, that might be for the best. Yeah, I, I'm just gonna lay up to the middle. I don't know how you would get all the way down All right, there. don't run over that lizard. I see, oh, go little dude. Go ahead. Okay, we're clear. I'm just gonna follow the, bar mar the ball markers. Tongue twister for this one. You can go ahead and set up. I'm gonna be a minute, I'm gonna roll around. But I'll be somewhere near that drain. I don't see how else you're supposed to be able to get close to it in one. Yeah, that works. Oh, hey girl, how you doing? All right, I guess. About to and sneeze. <laughs> now we it. should be able to just curve it around this hump all the way up there. That might funnel. That's too hard. I don't know why I hit that so hard. That was terrible. You don't need much. This is still one of my favorite courses to play. That could be really good. You know what, go ahead, that was great. Thank you. Good three. Thanks. Yeah, of all the courses we played, I think we play over 400 individual courses now. This is definitely still in my top five. Probably top three. If I would have made that, it might have been top two. At least I got par. If you're ever down here, definitely come check this place out. And the workers actually said when we were paying, because they recognized us because of the camera, that a bunch of you guys that have come here have said that it's been because of the videos, which they thought was really cool also. So thank you. If you ever come play here and you watch the videos, let them know. We appreciate it and they do too. It's really cool. Next up, par four, 77 feet. That's a good spot. When you basically hit the ball marker, you know you're in a good spot. Oh yeah, you can basically just like tap it and it roll all the way down once it clears that little hill. Also, I apologize for the leaf lower noise in the background, guys. Hopefully it's not picking it up too much. <laughs> right into the ball marker. I don't think that's actually what those are called, so I apologize. Y'all can let me know in the comments what their t actual term is. Nope. I saw it's a marker of some kind, and it's squirrel. a ball. Get a squirrel. I think he's got a nut in his mouth. His mouth's open. Yeah, he does. That might hit the flag. What's up, dude? Get it. You want to go down there and top my ball in? It would count. <laughs> <laughs> Want to trickle down there. You did really well in the back half. Or basically it's hole six after that one. Sweet. Last hole, par four, 105 feet. One of the longest holes here. Straight shot up to the flag. I hope that's hard enough. Please, please. How did that get to the green? <laughs> I have no, I thought it was gonna hit that bunker and just stop.
Oh. Wow. That is an incredible finish. I like that. Good job. That is a great two for both of us. That was so much fun. I think it turned around for me, but I, was, I still on the struggle bus there. We were filming this like first thing in the morning. So it was the yeah. first game of the day and all that too. So, and, and it's hot and humid, so. It's hot and humid and I've got a little bit of allergies, a little slight cold, I don't know. So my head's a little fun. <laughs> she was on the struggle bus a little bit. <laughs> Be ready for the scores? Yeah. So par was 72 and the entire course length was 1,488 feet, which is, that's a lot. And the final scores were, you had 62, 10 under par. I had oh, 58. It was only a four stroke good. game actually. Yeah. Good job. And I got a hole in one, which yeah, is awesome. Good. But guys, I hope y'all did enjoy this video. If you are new, please subscribe. Again, come check this place out. Let them know if you come because you've seen the videos. They really love that. But thank y'all for watching. Have a great day. We'll see you very soon in the next video. Bye. Later.